It's Ian at KarateMart.com. In this video, I want to take a closer look at the steel Eskrima stick, and I just happen to have one right here. Now, we've been getting a lot of requests recently uh, to kind of improve our collection of metal weapons, so we've got a new line of uh, steel as well as some aluminum weapons uh, on the site, which you can check out. But here's the one I got here. It's the steel um, Eskrima stick. Uh, this guy is an absolute monster. Uh, weighs about a pound and a half. I think it's one pound nine. Uh, 26 inches long, one inch around. It's exactly perfectly sized for an Eskrima. Uh, it's got this uh, machined uh, kind of ribbed grip here in the handle that I just love. Uh, and then here's the deal with this Eskrima stick. It's uh, easily double the weight of a typical Eskrima. Uh, maybe not something you'd want to go uh, into combat with, but um, for practicing and developing, uh, you know, your Eskrima technique, the extra force that you need to put into your arm and hand to move this thing with, um, you know, to move it around and through the air really develops the muscles and the strength that you need so that when you switch to a more traditional, one of the bamboo or rattan ones, uh, we actually don't sell any bamboo ones though, but the rattan, uh, when you switch to a lighter stick, uh, you will notice that your speed is dramatically increased from having practiced with a, uh, a much heavier weapon. Uh, now this is made uh, from a 14 gauge mild steel. Um, it's super, it's, it's super brutal. If you wanted to use this as a weapon, you could go crashing and marauding all through the city, uh, perfect for the apocalypse, um, or uh, training uh, legitimately Eskrimas in your dojo um, and practicing, uh, you know, your Eskrima moves. Uh, this is one of the newest weapons at KarateMart.com. Uh, it's only available at KarateMart.com. We are very proud of it, and we want you to check it out.